Well, we have some great people in the Republican Party that could do a great job as speaker. Well, what about Mary I'll do whatever it is to help, but my speaker. Uh, 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 a lot of people have been calling me about speaker. All I can say is we'll do whatever's best for the country and for the Republican Party. We have some great people. We just want to say we have some great, great people. Would you take the job? A lot of people have asked me about it. I'm focused. You know, we're leading. I don't know you. I'm sure you don't read too much in the papers. But we're leading by like 50 points. Hey, they asking Trump about it, man. And Trump is letting them know, look, he's doing his little move he do when he talk. Like, this is how I control everything I'm talking about. When if the last, when's the last time, if y'all can let me know in the comments, when's the last time someone asked um, Joe Biden a question? Reporters asked him a question. He stopped what he was doing and just started talking. He started just having a conversation about whatever they was having, they was asking him about. Can he do that? Like, is his mind in a position where he can actually do that? All right. And then watch this right here. This shows how sharp his mind is because they're asking Trump about becoming the Speaker of the House. Right. And he's not ducking and dodging it. But one thing that he will do, he will shift the conversation over to what he wanted to talk about. All right. Like he says, there's a bunch of people who will, who will be a great Speaker of the House. Um, we have a bunch of people that we can put in that position right now, right away. But, 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 but we are leading in the polls and I'm about to be the president in 2024 once we get over this BS that they're trying to put on me to put the wool over y'all eyes because Satan is slippery and slithery and sneaky and he's a rat bastard and he goes by the name of um, well y'all can name whoever y'all want to name fill in the blank but Satan is real okay and if y'all don't think he's real you're blind you're deaf dumb and blind and what's supposed to happen to our phones today also something is supposed to happen to our phones today at like 2 o'clock or 4 o'clock or something like that what's that about people are all afraid about it like what's why y'all so spooky about stuff uh, hold on I'm, I'm gonna show y'all the rest of this why are y'all so spooky about things or maybe i'm just naive I'm, I'm so naive that i don't worry about anything too much i pray about it i put it in god's hands and i go handle my business but i see a lot of people all scared <gasps> who they supposed to be sending something to our phones at like 4 30 it's gonna be the end of the world <gasps> what's going on at 2 20 they're sending something to our phones they about to shock the world with it oh my gracious no man relax uh, i mean i love y'all man but y'all so daggone spooky and scary sometimes you can't be no leader like that you can't be no soldier like that always afraid of what's around the corner now approach it ready to whoop some ass how about that approach that corner like if a boogeyman jump out i'm not running if a boogeyman jump out i'm put these hands on him bro i'm putting these hands on him Period. Bang, 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 bang. All right, let's get back to uh, to Trump ducking this question. The president, you know, my focus is totally on that. If I can help them during the process, I would do it. But we have some great people in the Republican Party that could do a great job as speaker. Well, what about Mary? Well, Mary Taylor Greene called for you to be speaker yesterday. Uh, I think she's a wonderful woman. Mind you. A lot of other people I'll do whatever it is to help, but my... Yeah, I heard that. He said, I would do whatever it is to help. Y'all hear that, right? He's saying, I'm not vying for the job. There are other people who can be speaker. And y'all already know that my plate is pretty full right now. Y'all, y'all, it's, it's really full. They're trying to keep me in the courts so I can't run. They're trying to throw all this smut on my name, all this dirt on my name. And they put a judge on my case who clearly is biased against me. Clearly. And he's not hiding it. This dude says if the jury says that Trump is, um, is, is innocent, then I have my own ways of saying that, you know what, maybe the jury didn't, the jury didn't make their, they didn't make a good decision. Decision. I'm going to overrule that. This dude said that. And if I'm getting loud and wrong, please feel free to correct me because I've been wrong a whole lot. I don't claim to be right all the time, nor no, no one should be um, claim to be right all the time. But some judge that's over Trump's case is saying that he's already not even considering what the jury is going to say because he will override them if they don't say whatever he wants to say. Have y'all heard about that? My focus, my total focus is being president and quite honestly, making America great again because we are living in a country in decline. This is a country that's failing badly. We're not respected in the world. 
Interest rates are through the roof. Taxes are through the roof. Inflation is horrible. What it's done to us, it's eating us alive. Energy is now over $5. I was at $1.87. It's over $5. What's happened to our country with Afghanistan, that horrible removal, the most embarrassing moment, I think, in our country's history. So I'm running for president. I'm up by 40 and 50 points and more in some cases. But whatever I can do to help with regard to speaker is good. By the way, I'm also leading Biden by a lot. If I wasn't, I wouldn't have trials like this. Thank you very much. Now, some people, y'all need to stop calling him celebrity in chief just simply because he's popular that's that's how haters talk that's that, let me let y'all know that right now that's how haters talk if you're calling him celebrity in chief you are a hater <laughs> period i don't care if it's your favorite content creator i don't care if it's your favorite um politician if they calling him celebrity in chief that's because they are a hate her all right it's not his fault that he's um that he's popular the thing is do he get the job done does he get the do he get the job done that's the question and if the answer is yes then he's the best person for the job and if the person that's got that got the job right now is not getting the job done then kick his ass out they need to be ousted next how about that shoot vote van for president no don't vote for me for president i would <laughs> i would tear this country up i don't know a daggone thing when it comes to, um when it comes to being the president bro at all